Yo, 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 what's going on, guys? So, uh, I'm watching this video uh, from the channel, The Salty Cracker. So, I don't know how many people know about this guy, but if you're interested in, like, other forms of media and issues that aren't being talked about in the mainstream, probably want to check this guy out. But, um, so we get a story about this anti-violent activist who was shot dead. And the story is, while attacking a woman with a butcher knife, there is a video. It shows kind of, like, leading up to him being shot. <clears throat> so, uh, that prompted me to research the story. And I'm over here looking, and I see a few things here. And my next thing would be looking at the numbers known as gematria and numerology and dates on the calendar and this code of letters and numbers using an alphabet. So you got the alphabet, you got the alphabet backwards, and then you got numerology forwards and backwards. If you don't know what that is, I'll explain it in another video. Um, but yeah, so check this out, right? So according to the story... This guy, Tyree Moorhead or whatever his name is, he was killed on November 6th. And according to the story, he was shot on November 6th, uh, roughly 13 times. And uh, it was because he was supposedly attacking somebody with a butcher knife. Now, I guess the story goes on to say that the person wasn't stabbed and... He was uh, a prominent activist in the community. He created these things called no-shoot zones. So it says no-shoot zone, but he had several of them around the city. So no-shoot zones. And so I want to break this down for you real quick without wasting too much time. So look at this. Anti-gun activist, right? Look at the gematria and the date numerology and all this stuff. I'll break it down so everyone can understand what I'm showing here. So the first thing I seen was the 99, when you flip the alphabet around and use the rules of numerology. Numerology is taking a double digit number, reducing it to a single digit number. So that equals 99, and then look at the guy's name, which again, it could be, this could be pure coincidence, but in the same cipher, his full name equals 99, right? And the headline is, you know, attacking the woman with a butcher knife. So I just decided to type in, you know, uh, butcher knife, you know. And again, this, a lot of this stuff can be manipulated. But again, what are the odds of all this? So in uh, numerology, butcher knife sums to 59. And... No shoot zones in the same cipher, something to 59. And this all happened on a 59 date numerology, as you can see from the chart here. Got the 59. And I'm sure there's other stuff, but for the sake of not making the video super duper duper long, I just wanted to make those two points the 59 and the 99. And this is another interesting thing here, the 139, which is the 34th prime number. So 139 is the 34th prime number. And according to the story, it says he was shot around 3.40 p.m. So, you know, 3.40 can look a lot like 34. So a lot of interesting things here. I'm sure that, you know, if you type out West Baltimore and this and that and all this other stuff, you know, you'll find connections anytime you do look into stuff like this. But again, you got to ask yourself, what are the odds? And, you know, 46 years old, huh? I'm sure there's something with 199, you know, I wouldn't be surprised. You know, 199 is the uh, 46th prime number. So I wouldn't be surprised if uh, you play around and look. You probably will find a 199 somewhere. But, uh, yeah, you know, RIP to this man. And, again, I mean, who knows, you know, like these numbers, they 
match up and stuff and people are dying and or maybe maybe it's just you know an illusion i don't you know again i like to document this stuff because i find it interesting and um yeah i mean again maybe you know sometimes you can look a little too deep into certain things but i don't i don't think the stuff is coincidental um but yeah you can you can definitely look at uh the story if you like and do what I'm doing just to see if there's any parallels. But all right. <laughs>